channel so today i'm back with another video this video is going to be a review on another foundation so today's review is going to be on the new l'oreal impalable total cover foundation um they came out with another foundation from the same impalable line but this is the total cover i believe this is the third one the first one is um matte total matte i believe the other one is total glow and this is the total cover it's fairly new it just came out a couple months ago so i decided to do a review on it all right so this foundation claims to be a full coverage foundation where up to 24 hours it has a complete coverage and it has an air light texture it comes in 12 different shades i got mine in 305 which is natural beige okay so a quick thing that i want to mention it's about the shades um the bottles have the actual shade painted on the outside so it has like a weird um how can i put this like a weird color on the outside but it's not the actual color of the foundation it's just because it's painted so it looks probably like two shades darker than your own skin and it has like this pink undertone to it but it's just the outside of the bottle like you can see like really really close to to the lid um, with that line where it's not painted you're gonna be able to see the actual foundation the actual um, Color of the foundation. So just try to go by them because if you just look at the bottle like that um, You're gonna be like, okay, that's not for me. That's not my color at all So just um, be careful when you're choosing your color So yeah, the packaging comes like this. It's like a little tube, which I really like it's not a pump but I really appreciate the the actual packaging the, the dispenser thingy because i think it's really really easy um rather than just having like the big um i guess like the big hole where you just like it's kind of like annoying kind of like um hard to dispense um your foundation so i really 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 like the packaging all right so i'm gonna go ahead and move on to the demo Okay, so my face is primed and ready to go. So I'm just gonna go ahead and start with the application. And I'm gonna apply some on the top of my hand, like I always do. And it's like a really, really moussey consist consistency. Like, look at that. So I'm gonna start with that much. Rather than dotting it all over my face, I'm gonna get a foundation brush like this. And I'm gonna start to put it all over my my skin because for some reason I can already tell that it's gonna be kind of like hard to blend so and then I'm taking the blending foundation brush and just blend it everywhere okay so one thing that i can tell you right now about the air light texture that is completely true like i barely feel like i'm putting something on my face so that's already one point for the foundation now about the coverage i don't think this foundation is a full coverage it is not a full coverage at all i can i can still see all of my freckles i have a lot of freckles on my face so that's why i will never have like a clear face like nothing on my face because i do have freckles a lot of freckles so i can still see all of them not as much but i can see all of them but the texture and the feeling of the foundation it's amazing it's like i don't feel like i have anything on my face but that goes for the coverage as well it's like i wouldn't like a coverage like a light coverage like this one i'm always looking for like a full coverage foundation um but what i'm gonna check if is if if i can build it up because right now it feels so weightless so soft so I don't know so natural on my face so I'm gonna check right now by adding another layer and see how that works let's see if we can build up the coverage a little more okay so this is my second layer that I'm applying right now 
see how that one looks okay so I'm done applying the second layer and still not a full coverage I will consider this probably maybe like a medium coverage so because it's to my preference to my desire is not a full coverage um, I personally think that this foundation is not a full coverage at all whatsoever it's not full coverage I don't know why it says that it's a full coverage because I don't think it's a full coverage and crazy because I am applying it with a brush which you will always get a full coverage when you apply your foundation with a brush um, rather than a sponge so if I would apply it with a sponge this would it be not a full coverage at all like not even a light coverage I don't know what it will be so um, but everything else is true I mean the texture it's pretty much like an air light texture like when I was putting the foundation it felt like I was just putting foam on my face like so foam it was just crazy it's so soft it's so um it's not heavy at all it's really really featherly I don't know I don't know how to explain it it's really really light and it has like a moussey texture so I almost thought that it was gonna be really really hard to blend it out but it was really really easy so it's great other than the coverage I feel like the foundation it's really really great um, I will have to wear it the entire day so I can see if it's actually a 24 hour um, wear foundation which I don't know who will wear that a foundation for that long but we'll see so yeah but I'm gonna go ahead and do the rest of my makeup so you guys can see the finishing look all right you guys so this is the finishing look with the rest of my makeup on and so far so good the foundation is doing a pretty good job so the texture is really really comfortable it's really lightweight I barely feel it on my skin if I touch it it's like I, I only have powder on my face um now for the color it's it's a perfect match on my skin like I say you just have to find the right um, color for you now for the finish I will say it has a really natural finish like it's not something do it it's not something matte either I always say my foundation just because I like to say my foundation all the time but I did notice um, that without setting it it was it was perfectly fine it wasn't dewy at all so I really really like that now the only thing with this foundation will be the coverage it's not a full coverage foundation i mean um you can see that it's it's doing a pretty good job but not something like oh my god this is a completely full coverage foundation i would say it's in between a light to a medium full coverage but other than that the foundation it's great i mean i like it i like it that doesn't feel heavy on my on my face it's not cakey at all but we'll see um um, I want to try it for the rest of the day and see exactly how it turns out to be uh, Because it says that it's a long wearing foundation I mean, I don't wear my foundation for 24 hours But I do want to wear it the entire day and see how it turned out to be by the end of the day So yeah, this is the end of this review and demo. I hope you guys enjoy this video If you guys have any questions, just go ahead and let me know down below so yeah, thank you so much for watching. Like always, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye. Be careful when you're choosing your shade and make sure you're getting the right shade and make sure that you're <laughs> The texture feels really, really good. It's really, really good. It feels like I have nothing on my face. The color, um, it's it's a good color. I think it's a great match for my skin tone. You just gotta find. Ariana, can you have <laughs>